What's up, guys? <laughs> you did that on purpose. Didn't you? <laughs> What's up guys, Jace 2 cents here and we're gonna do a vlog. We haven't done anything like very impersonal and vloggy, but check this out, we've got parts. We're gonna build a computer for, where are you? There he is. Wait, wait. <laughs> Yay, I'm getting a computer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is Phil. I know you guys have seen him in the vlogs a little bit. You guys know this guy already. We don't care. So here's what we're gonna do. He's been editing since he started for me on his MacBook Pro. I promised him an editing rig. We're gonna build that right now. We're gonna build a Threadripper a 1920X system for him. We still have the server back there that's gonna ultimately be his editing rig, but we're not done with that yet. We still have to get my RAID controller, get all the RAID set up and the unraid and all that, because that's gonna double as a server and a workstation, so stay tuned for that. So this is a temporary rig for him to use in the meantime. So I figured, Instead of me building it, part of the things he had on his resume when he applied here was that he could build a computer. It's time to test that. Does that mean I could go? No, no. Oh. <laughs> All right, so you get to help him if he needs it. Like you could be the lifeline, which is already comical the lifeline. in itself. Wait, you don't need help, right? Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> but I think I think I think Phil can handle this. No, I need a ladder. That's what I need. I'm literally cutting this. Like, how tall are you? Five foot two ish. Are you trying to squeeze an inch in? Cause I'm, all right, I'm 6'4", and if I stand next to him, <laughs> I, and that's eye level right there. You got it. Hold on, wait. Right, that's eye level. <laughs> There's Nick. Oh, stupid shipping label. <laughs> See, I already, need, I already need Nick's help. And they give me a hard time for unboxing. Technically, this isn't hey, part of the building. Why is it the biggest case? The case is like- Oh, this has handles. Yeah, but they give, this is like a reusable shopping bag if you go to Costco. <laughs> <laughs> if you go to Costco, seriously. Hey, does this work like in Metal Gear Solid? I think so. Oh shit, where'd you go? Bill. What? Where are you? Oh, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> This is the new H500 from Cooler Master. This is the mesh. So the shortcomings of the other one, if you recall, <laughs> Steve at Gamers Nexus, his complete disdain and hatred for that case. Rightfully so, all the plastic in the front blocked off all the airflow, but now this is wide open on the front, giving it air, plenty of airflow. And as you can see, we opted for the white one. The question is, how many average people does it take to build a computer? ROG Strix X399, because three is higher than two. Wait, one. is this the board with the blood on it? No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> that's that's this one right here. <laughs> now, obviously, since this is vlog style, we're not sitting here going over all the parts and the rationale behind it. We'll put a link in the description below to all the parts if you guys are wondering. But this is pretty much just grabbed off of the inventory shelf, and like I said, it's a temporary build. But the question is whether or not they can actually build it. I might be here until next week, but we can build it. <laughs> you want to do the? Um... Why are we doing that first? Okay. Wait, why? I'll you see. probably want to do the cooler first. Yeah. Oh. But you got to put it but in there. But then I have to, first. yeah, I have to put it in there. Okay. Nick already tried to mount the motherboard without the standoffs. <laughs> There's literally two people trying to put a motherboard or standoffs in a case. This is fun. This is a team building activity. Yeah, this is, it's co-op. It's co-op PC building. Yeah, dude. This idea was a whole lot better on paper. <laughs> oh, this is right. I think the the um the threads were tapped. You're tapped. I mean the threads were ripped. We had actually talked about putting the symbiote build on his desk, but I was like, no, I don't want to. I want to be back here in my videos where you can see it. I am installing the motherboard secure screws into the standoffs that have been installed by Nick into this case. What's next is cooler. So these guys just showed up. These are custom cable sleeves from Ensource Customs. Uh, super high quality. Holy crap. Really the picture. More tippy toe action. So if you're new around here, Phil is actually the newest member of our team. He is a camera operator slash editor, a way better editor than me, that's for damn sure. So that's why if you've noticed any sort of improvement in our videos over the last couple of weeks, it's because that little guy back there, he's awesome. We like him. That's why we're building him a computer. No, <laughs> I was pointing. On camera, it looks like I'm pointing at Phil. Hold look on, at, look at the, let me no, help. no, no look at the lens. Look at the screen. See, see? Oh. Do you see? Yeah, okay, I get it. <laughs> Frickin' screws. You don't have to do them all, you know? You could've just done the two ends and like, those two. Oh yeah, you're right. Oh, that's why you're the professional PC builder. Look at that. Sexy. Grab all three of those fan things and then run them through the same uh, hole that the uh, EPS uh, is running through. Copy that. Normally I would've already mounted the thing, screwed it in and then been like, oh, 
Where am I gonna mount? We're gonna route these cables. I don't think this is enough thermal paste. If you actually. do it the wrong way, the internet will forever call you a noob. <laughs> yeah, but we did the happy face already. There's so. no such thing as the wrong way anymore. Just <laughs> yeah. Put the whole tube in and call it a day. <laughs> it ran out. <laughs> This is what happens when a Mac user tries to build PC. I can finally right click. So I think the next step is you take this and then you just kind of... Oh. Oh no wait, I know what that's for. This is actually the first motherboard that I've messed around with, with... Use some uh, force. Yeah. Don't with, be, um... Don't be scared. Eight dim slots, like... So what we've basically done for him today is we have, uh... Not only got him building his own editing rig, albeit temporary, the... we've got him hopping off of his MacBook Pro and onto a real piece of machinery. <laughs> that accent! <laughs> Don't even think about trying to run away. The dad jokes. The dad jokes. I'm gonna eat that big pizza. <laughs> Can you record? What are you looking for? Say the cables. Or say the cable. Yeah, say the cables. That would be in the motherboard box. Motherboard box. Oh, right. Okay, so the motherboard box that when I asked like, oh, do we need anything else in here? You're like, no, I think we're good. What else? This is the most disorganized build table right now just because I'm in charge. This is like, that's like one of those hidden skills that, um, that Jay and like, you know, people that are good at this YouTube stuff have is that I was about to just build this cage like directly behind this PC case. And I'm Fefa too, so you would never see me. And like, you know, he always makes a good point of like being in front of the camera, having the lighting, you know, be correct and all that sort of stuff. And it's just like weird because not only am I having to think about building a computer, I'm having to think about, um, you know, being shorter than the computer and being in front of the computer as well. So you guys can see me. So I was watching this channel called Jay's Two Cents the other day. And then, you know, he was talking about cable management and they mentioned that like, you don't want to attach the SATA cable and then go wrangle it because then you're going to break this shit and then your shit's broken. Oh yeah, so that was a really weird uh, drive cage um, because we thought originally that came out the back, the back side of this, but we had to take off because this guy goes here and this guy goes up there. And then in order to take this off to access the drive cage, you actually have to take this piece and the shroud off. So. Um, yeah, for those of you guys building in this case, I was just basically pulling at it from the back and it wasn't working, so yeah, we had to just practically disassemble half of it, but yeah, I mean, it's cool and it's all hidden and everything. So set this aside for now. I'll probably just mount this right now. Just a thousand watts of power! One point zero zero uh, kilowatts! <laughs> or a sync RGB graphics card. Everyone knows RGB equals more FPS. Hashtag thick with two C's. Unfortunately, we can't use these cables that, the, they, that arrived today because it's an eight pin and a six pin, and this is dual eight pins. Wah, wah. So now we get to use these beautiful cables here. <laughs> that face of betrayal. It's oh, oh, that, Only some of it. Oh my God, it's everywhere. <laughs> it's <always some> <laughs> That was 99 cents of my money. Water will help delete the memories. Really? Ah, oh, you peed yourself. <laughs> Where do we usually eat? Ow, yeah, so ready. Haven't seen the backside yet. Oh, it's not all that bad. It's just like you don't have enough length on some of the stuff to make it like super tight. So yeah, that's not that bad. The table, however. Yeah. <laughs> the all the zip tie deaths. <laughs> it's <laughs> Where is Phil? <laughs> there he is! <laughs> okay, he's gonna put this back together and then we're gonna see if it boots. And then he's gonna clean up his mess, isn't he? Nick! Okay. It took him four hours. <laughs> Not even joking, it took four hours. Yeah, I gotta got caught up in the, um, the cable management. The RGB. The R and the RGB, the... I wanna use a different finger, but that... It still looks janky, but I don't even care anymore. Anyway. That was a hard push. You gotta make Give sure. Give me the remote control. You gotta make sure that it knows it. Uh, and, and do the remote control. Oh, uh, unbox it. Oh, look at that, you got a post. Hey! Oh, oh. <laughs> sorry. Hey! But it doesn't work entirely because you have no LEDs. I broke my RGB. 
You broke your RGBs. You might have taped it in backwards. Um, oh, um, this fan is turning. Oh, yeah. Wait, what the hell? That's the one that we plugged into. Now we gotta check your management because you started yanking on everything. Yeah. It mostly works. Yeah, it mostly works. Mm -hmm. All right, well, at least it's not exploding, so we'll figure out why the rear fan doesn't work and we'll get the LEDs to work, but uh, it's time to go. Anyway, I, I guess right -click now. technically he built the computer. Nick helped. He's mad at me. I spilled tea on him. I don't really care. All right, guys, I'm gonna go. Thanks for watching. <laughs> we'll see you in the next one. I fucking knew it. <laughs>